Hi, I am going to discuss about Xilinx 4000 FEGA. It is an FEGA family. We know that FEGA means Field Programmable Gate Array. And by using FEGA design flow, we can design user required chips, electronic chips. So basically, uh, the combination or else uh, two or more CLBs are included in uh, 4000 FEGA. So here the CLBs means configurable logic blocks and it is having logic functions actually and of course the CLB is internally having lookup tables, multiplexers, flip flops and of course input output pads and interconnections interconnections and uh, different types of uh, logics are we know that uh, image capturing and uh, from and uh, logic simple logics are a plus b and moving data from one place to another place mnsb and a division by b like that different different tasks uh, are required if you consider a small processor so coming to the block diagram you can see this architecture this is for xilinx series for all all topics it is the same block diagram xilinx 3000 and xilinx 4000 xilinx spartan xilinx spartan 2 or else excel so here you can see this this is the combination of clbs clb and internally having logics and this is the clb configurable logic blocks as i said uh, if you want to capture the image uh, one task is required that is uh, logic function and uh, similarly or else small example if you take a plus b it is a logic functions so like that they depends on the user requirement uh, uh, the electronics chip they are designed so here you can see this uh, it is having a switch matrix this is the main advantage for the xilinx uh, series so switch matrix is used to select the user required task uh, immediately so these are the input output pads and of course these are the interconnections uh, uh, interconnections between them between the devices so by using this we can execute the our required task i am assuming this is emnsp switch matrix is used to uh, select the our required task and input output ports are used to select the uh, our required output as well as the required input devices so this is about architecture nothing else two or more uh, clbs are uh, uh, included then it is uh, named as architecture for xilinx uh, series either xilinx 4000 xilinx uh, spartan xilinx uh, excel coming to the logic element uh, internally it is having logic blocks uh, uh, here you can see this uh, lookup tables are there internally so clbs are having uh, that is lookup tables uh, three lookup tables are there and these are the multiplexers and uh, these are the flip flops these are the flip flops so you can see this here the three lookup tables are there but if you go for uh, vertex uh, um, Ultraflex, not Vertex. Ultraflex, if you go for Ultraflex company, uh, Ultraflex company, it is having only one uh, lookup table. But here you can see this in Xilinx series, there are three, three lookup tables are there. Just assume that uh, simple example here G1, G4 means A plus B, or G1 means image capturing, image capturing, G2 means moving data from one place to another place, like this different, uh, just assumption the different different tasks are there uh, from the lookup tables here f1 to f4 also different different types of task and from this uh, we can uh, select the required task from the out of eight we can select again by using this lookup table so these are the multiplexers uh, by using this you can select the user required data and these flip-flops are used to store the data of course these are the control signals uh, to control the input output signals so by uh, using these interconnections, uh, lookup tables and uh, multiplexers and flip flops, we are going to execute our user required uh, logic. So this is about the Xilinx uh, 4000 uh, uh, logic block.
थैंक यू